Hey guys, welcome back to Broken Arrow Hunting. In today's episode, we're going to be actually, uh, I'm going to be filming for uh, my little brother. We're going to be doing a youth turkey hunt down south uh, from where I live, where I shot my eight point this past year, my Pennsylvania uh, buck, where I filled that tag. We're hunting there, somewhat close to where I actually shot him. Um, around here, we had past success. It laid out for a perfect uh, morning, so you guys will have to wait and see what happens. We heard a ton of action um, in the early morning where there was just gobblers, gobble. I mean, there must have been five roost sites all around this field we're set up in, but uh, you'll come to see what the problem is. this video, could you guys uh, hit the subscribe button? We're at 105 subscribers. Thank you guys for getting me over 100 subscribers. Let's move on to 200, and uh, yeah, so if you could hit that subscribe button, it'd really help me. Uh, it keeps me motivated to keep making these videos for you guys, and uh, stay tuned. So right off when sunrise hit, gobblers were gobbling all over the roost. I mean, they're going crazy, gobbling the heads off. Well, as the morning progressed, we soon realized that they were obviously hend up. Um, you know, this place, I shot gobblers here before, and if they're hend up, they just aren't going to come into this field. We don't have permission to hunt the fields where they flew into, or we'd be set up right in those fields, like I said. But um, the, the matter of fact was, is we weren't allowed to, and um, being that we had to set up in a smaller field off of the big uh, fields where they plant soybeans and corn around there and those gobblers just flew straight off the roost into those uh, uh, fields with hens. Uh, I think they were roosting with hens and they just didn't come off those hens uh, and I think that was the main reason that we really didn't have the action that we should have. We didn't see turkeys but we heard a ton. I mean we really didn't have one working. Like I said I like running and gunning but when it comes to youth day uh, we usually just set up blind and hope for the best, but like I said, those gobblers were hand up and it just didn't help. Now with that being said, on a brighter note, uh, deer scene's going to be very promising there. Uh, we saw probably 20 deer maybe, uh, definitely in the teens with deer, um, and we saw some mature bucks were, uh, just sitting there in the blind. So I'm really uh, pumped for that just to see them. But it always seems like when you're turkey hunting, you'll see deer, and when you're deer hunting, you'll see a ton of turkeys. But uh, like I said, those gobblers were hand up, and they were really hard to call in. Like when I shot my biggest bird down there, um, we called in two hens in the field first, and then after we called those two hens in, that's when the long beard came in. And I mean, that's just how it works down there, is you gotta call the hens in the field, or they ha you gotta find a lone gobbler. And it didn't seem like a lot of those gobblers were alone, and we didn't really have one that committed. Next year, coming right to you. I'm 
thought they might be as big as they are. I have a place to decoys. It's going to come right up. Take a look. He'd be just looking at something. Just be honest that there might be a turkey or something coming to you. Just tell him. That's a nice, that's gonna be a nice buck right there. But it's called hunting and not killing, and uh, that's how hunting goes sometimes, is you don't have the cards uh, in your favor. And like in this hunt, they really weren't in our favor. I mean, the morning played out perfectly. It was about 50 degrees, 60 degrees at the, as the morning progressed. And there was no rain, it was partly cloudy, and you couldn't ask for a better day. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this youth hunt video. It was my little brother's last youth hunt. Uh, sadly, we couldn't get him a gobbler. That's just how hunting goes, like I said. Um, turkey season will be opening from the day I'm filming this in uh, two days. So, turkey season's gonna be coming in. I'm gonna be doing a ton of turkey hunting. I'm hoping to get one down. I got a flock roosted where I know there's some mature gobblers along with some jakes. I don't plan on shooting a jake, but um, hopefully I can get in one of those gobblers and that's what I'll probably be doing Saturday if I'm not doing that I'll probably head back down uh, south and hunt some uh, gobblers down there and maybe try to call in one, off one of those hens so hopefully we can uh, pull one together and maybe take take one's head off the crossbow or uh, shoot one in the face at the, the old 12 gauge so stay tuned for that subscribe for more if you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you guys in the next one